Welcome to MNM YouTube channel. Today we are going to start with a tutorial in embroidery. So we learn the basic stitches in embroidery. Here we start with the first stitch that is the hemming stitch which is used to stitch the borders of cloth. Hemming stitch is used to cover up the borders so that the threads they won't come out. So let's start with the hemming stitch. We need a needle and we need a thread. So usually I keep the threads braided so that it is easy to take out. So I take two strands from that six stranded thread and I insert the thread through the needle and a knot is made at one end. The other end is kept free. So here we are going to start the stitch. We'll fold the cloth twice. Here's one fold. And here we have the second fold. And just press it so that we can keep the cloth tight. Here we start the stitch. We cover up the cloth to the wrong side, okay? We insert the needle through the lower piece of cloth and we take it through the folded push. Take the needle through the lower piece, then we take it through the folded part. So here we get slanted stitches. So let's continue like this. First we'll insert the needle through the lower side, then we take it through the folded portion. So there as you can see, the major portion of the thread is found in the wrong side of the cloth. On the other side, we can see the small dots or a small point. So usually uh, we use same thread, same color of thread, color as that of the cloth so that the thread is not visible on the cloth. Usually we don't want borders to be visible. Here I have taken a contrast color so that you can see it easily. So here I'm just pressing the borders to make the cloth tight and we continue the stitch. So when we come to corners, we'll just stop the stitching and we just fold the other side. So we fold towards the wrong side twice and from the corner we start the stitch, the hemming stitch. So the stitch is very useful to sew the borders or we can even make handkerchief out of it. For all the beginners in embroidery, hemming stitch is one of the basic stitches. As I said, we should press this folded region so as the cloth is kept tight and it is easy for stitching. And when coming to the borders, we will just start from the corners. We will fold it and we will start stitching from the corner. Now we can see the thread is going to get over so we are going to make a knot. We take out the needle and make a loop using the thread and take out the strand through that loop and press it against the cloth and pull it. That is a basic knot actually. And just cut out the extra thread. Let's take another two strands of thread and here the knot is made by rolling the thread with the help of the fingers and pulling it out. 
as I said before, one end has got the knot and the other end is kept free. So let's continue the stitch. So we have come to the last edge of the cloth. So we are stitching the border. We have reached the end and we are going to put the knot. We have to make a loop with a thread. A loop is made and the needle is taken through it and it is pulled out. You can repeat it so that the knot is made tight. And cut out the extra thread. So we have done with the hem stitch. This is the wrong side of the cloth and as you can see this is the good side, the right side where the stitch can be visible only as dots. So when we use same color of thread it will be invisible. So it can be used to stitch handkerchief borders too. So thank you guys. So if you like it share and subscribe to our channel.